Hello everyone. I am Abhin Kadavi, Senior Solution Architect for Database Solutions. In this simple demo, let me show you on how to enable cost-effective zero RPO solution for Oracle databases on NetApp storage using SnapMirror Synchronous. Here I am logging to on command system manager to show the volume layout for my Oracle Rack ASM 19C database. OData, OCF, and OFRA are my data files, log files, and cluster files. Grid A and Grid B represent my Rack ASM binaries. OHOME and OHOME RC1 represents my database binaries. Now let's log into the party session and check the status of my DB services. CRM PRD1 is the database instance that is running on host 1 and CRMPRD2 is my Rack instance running on host. As a first step, let's go ahead and protect uh, all three of my volumes. Firstly, let's protect OCF volume, which is my cluster files. I'm choosing the replication as asynchronous and the type as mirror. I'm keeping the rest as default and saving this config. Similarly, let's protect OData in a synchronous mode. I'm choosing the synchronization mode as strict sync. And I'm changing the volume name suffix as underscore B to represent site B. Now let's speed up the same steps for OFRA volume. Once all the three are done, let's log in to cluster 2 and check the status of the volume relationships. As you see closely, the status is shown as transferring. Let's give a minute and wait for the baseline to get completed. Well, I could see our data is in sync. Now let's go ahead and simulate a disaster scenario in cluster 1. As you notice, all three of my volumes are offline. In parallel, you could notice all my synchronous replication relationships would have gone bad. Hence, you could see the status as unhealthy. Now, as a second step, let's go ahead and break the mirrors. Firstly, I'm breaking my cluster files. Similarly, let me quiesce the relationships of data and FRA. Well, all two of my synchronous volume relationships have been coised. Now let's go ahead and break them. Now as a result of this, you could notice three relationships have been broken off from its primary. Now, as a third step, you could log into the party session and discover all my new storage devices from site B. Well, you could see all those highlighted devices are coming from site B, which is cluster 2. Now let's go ahead and scan them as ASM disks on both the host. Well, let's give a break and check if Oracle can bring up its own service as part of its HAS capability. Well, the database instances are up and running on 
both rack 1 and rack 2 node. Thus you have noticed how a snap mirror synchronous can address a zero APS solution for Oracle database. Thanks for watching. For more information, refer to www.netapp.com.